Please welcome Cara Delevingne. Hello, everyone. Thank you very much for having me tonight. Um, I'm very happy to be here tonight to uh, present a new award for this year. So when Tallulah from Bugsy Malone said, I don't remember names, but I remember faces, she spoke for the entire film, theater, and fashion industries all together. Each a world where the face comes first. And after these last couple of years, um, after so many masks, I think we need faces more than ever. And sitting for a close up is also a very intimidating thing. You know, think of how many people you get this close to your face. This kind of proximity to a face only moisturizers, lovers, pets, or estheticians get. Uh, but these brave few sit where they cannot hide and they let us hover and watch every single movement. Tonight, I feel most privileged to talk about a face this year that has captivated the world, not only by her unique beauty, but her ability to tell a story with every eyebrow, blink, twitch, smile, and most importantly, a serene yet deadly stillness. After the extraordinary performance she gave this year, she is not only a face to remember, but a name even Tallulah would never forget. I'm also very lucky to know this woman behind the face, and her beauty radiates as brightly when your eyes are closed. I am beyond happy and proud to present the CFDA's first ever Face of the Year Award to a face that launched a thousand shipments of chess sets, Anya Taylor-Joy. Sweetest thing you've oh. um, Mr. Ford, thank you so much for letting me be here in front of such illustrious company. Wow. Um, I first fell in love with fashion through the magic of seeing a character appear fully fledged in front of you in a mirror. And that kind of transformative power has never left me, and I continue to be amazed. So, first and foremost, thank you to everybody here for the beautiful work that you do. It really transforms the way you feel about yourself. And thank you for that. I want to thank my team for always supporting me and for letting me grow. And also to everyone in this room that's allowed me to learn about fashion from people like you. Like That's the greatest education that one could ever ask for. And um, since this is the face, I guess I have to thank my parents. Because <laughs> um, they, they apparently made something that people are starting to like. So thank you very, very much. And thank you for having me.